Hey everyone, Chad Kaler, Bex Field Agronomist in East Central and Northeast Illinois. Today I want to visit with you about a topic that has quite a bit of controversy around it. Uh, it's early planted soybeans. You know, one of the things in over 20 years worth of Bex practical farm research, we found that the optimum planting date window for both corn and soybeans is the last two weeks in April. Early planted soybeans has gained quite a bit of attention over the last decade because as we see colder soils with a not so favorable forecast for planting corn, there's more of a tendency to think about planting soybeans now because we don't have that risk of imbibitional chilling like we do with corn. We don't see that as much of a factor. You know, one of the things that I've noticed uh, in, in years where we do have the opportunity to plant soybeans early, let's say uh, sometime in April, say the first two weeks in April, when soils are fit, conditions are dry enough, and we, we are able to get across that field very well uh, without creating a lot of compaction. Planting those soybeans early and we get a frost or freeze event or multiple events after those beans have emerged, the highest amount of survivability that I've seen is where we have less residue. So in a field like this behind me that was in corn last year that had aggressive fall tillage and very little residue right now in the spring, if this field is well drained and we go in and plant beans early whenever we don't have quite a favorable forecast for planting corn and we want to put soybeans in there, there's more survivability if those soybeans do emerge and get to a frost or freeze event come through. After emergence, we see more survivability of those plants whenever we have less residue. Um, so one of the key things, if you are going to plant soybeans early, is to go into fields that are well-drained, uh, highly productive, and that have less residue on them, and possibly ones that have good tillage and residue management applied to them. Uh, one of the other ways to do that, and make sure you're uh, going on to fields that, you know, if, if they are no-till, which I highly discourage that early planting of soybeans into no-till corn stalks, is if you are going to do that, make sure you're aggressively managing that residue with your planter attachments. Seed to soil contact and getting that residue out of the way is very important for the success of early planted soybeans. We know that there's a lot of potential advantages from planting soybeans early. Uh, we know there's a lot of risks associated as well. Node formation, we get more nodes plant, uh, produced from an earlier planted soybean plant, and there's more potential or more opportunity for higher yields. If you want to discuss early planted soybean opportunities or risk with your local Bex dealer or Bex seed advisor or field agronomist, give us a call. Thank you very much.